Hello, in last video we have learned how to uh, download and install those books and uh, how to mount assembly folder and how to install Notepad++. In this video we will learn how to use debug commands. Uh, debug means find and fix errors in program codes. So let's start to use debug. We'll open those books. So let's start with debugging. I will say dir and see the contents of assembly folder that I explained in the last video. I have debug executable file, which is application that I'm gonna work on. Let me clear the screen, CLS. Then I will say debug. Now I am in debug. I will uh, zoom in using magnifier. If I write question mark. All debugging commands will uh, appear for me. The commands that I'm gonna use is assemble, dump, enter, fill, go, hex, and input, move, and quiet, register, search, trace, and assemble. The first command that I'm gonna use is R. R show me the contents of all registers and the flags that I have and the instruction that I have. If I want to change the content of AX register, I will just say RAX and I will put some data, for example 2211. And if I want to change the content of BX register, I will say RBX and uh, the contents, for example, gonna be 4433 and enter. So now, if I check the register's content, I have AX and BX. The second command that I'm gonna use is assemble command. I have many methods to type. For example, if I want to write in code segment, I will just write like this, assemble at this logical address. Or by default, it's code segment. I just can say A100 or A space 100. All this method are two. So now I just written A100. Why I, sh I have chosen this address? Because I have already code segment, it's 073F and the instruction pointer is 100. Let's write assembly instructions. By the way, our experiment was on addressing modes. I will write some instruction. Each instruction will be on some addressing modes. So the first addressing mode is uh, immediate addressing mode. Data will be moved immediately to the registers of BX. 22F3 move base pointer 2233 and the next addressing mode will be direct addressing move location 0 AX move location to BX memory move memory location for BP. The next addressing mode will be register addressing. I will say move AX BX. The next one move B low C high. Move A high AL. And again, I will come back to immediate addressing move SI 100 and move the i sorry thousand and move the i two thousand so now i will go to base plus index addressing mode which is move ax memory location that of bx plus si and the next one move base pointer memory location of base pointer plus destination index cx register and the next addressing mode that i gonna use is indirect addressing move ax memory location of bx which is indirect addressing and the last one is base relative plus index move dx base a bx plus di plus 
3344 enter so now I have finished my assembling assembly instructions so from 100 to 126 I have my codes 220A that's good so now if I just write U which is unassemble command it will show me all this instruction by default it will start from offset 100 but now if I write U again it will go to the others if I want to sp uh, show specific uh, addresses I will just write U from 100 to 100 20a if I write enter all my instructions will appear I can show by another way I will say u cs from 100 space to 120a same method I want to execute this instruction one by one if I type r and enter I have my the first instruction that execute is move ax1234 I have trace command I will just type T and enter now I see the ax data changed to 1234 and the second one the content of BX register will be changed to 22F3 and the next instruction is move base pointer so BP will be changed to 2233 and for this command move ax to memory location 0 if I just type trace and enter now memory location 0 which is data segment here already 20 CD will be changed to 1234 of course let us check the memory content I have another command which is called dump I will say dump data segment 0 up to where up to one if i press enter this is little andean movement i have a low to low byte to offset zero and a high to offset one a low is how much 34 so offset zero will be 34 and uh, a high will be 12 i have 12 let me check again the instruction what gonna happen in next instruction i have move bx to memory location 2 now what i have i have moved 22 f3 to memory location 2 and 3 I will check again by another method I will say dump by default it's data segment from 0 up to where up to 3 I have this 2 which were before and this 22 F3 from BX register the next instruction will be base pointer to memory location 4 if I just type trace by the way I can execute more than one instruction at a time I can say trace two two instruction will be executed if I write t2 and enter so now we have two instruction that executed by the by one time the instruction base pointer already gone to the this location and the next instruction data of BX register copied to AX register if I see in this trace which happened AX register and BX register became the same if I check the memory location 4 dump 4 to 5 I have 22 33 which is base point content also I can say T equal CS 100 how many instruction for example for three instructions three instructions will execute for me all these options I have so after this base pointer is at 109 I'll just type trace 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 I have this instruction content of C high which is 00, zero will be copied to below so it will be 2200 zero. if I type trace now 2200 zero. and move I low to I high should be f3 f3 after that will be f3 f3 I have another command which called go I will change the instruction pointer uh, 200 r IP I will write 100 so then I will say go 
equal code segment hundred to to eleven A. If I enter, it will execute from hundred up to eleven A. I will type trace trace move SI and DI. So now content of SI became how much one thousand, and content of DI became how much two thousand. And now what I have the content of BX plus SI will be how much I have BX already 22 plus SI which is 1000 will be 3200 memo location of 3200 data segment of course its data are 00, zero. I can verify I will say dump 3200 so all of its data are zero so if I just write R and I have if I press tab now IX contents became zero and base pointer related to what to stack segment this segment deals with stack segment base pointer so I have this uh, table I have segment register and its offset the offset that deals with code segment is instruction pointer and the offset is which is dealing with the DS register as source index base register and destination index and the stack segment base pointer deals with and stack pointer for extra segment I have destination index so now it became clear for us so when I say move memo location of B P plus D I destination index, I have already base pointer which belongs to stack segment. Base pointer is how much twenty two thirty three, and the destination index is two thousand. We will add both of them. Will be four thousand two hundred thirty three, and the its data are zero zero. I will just write R. Uh, sorry R and T after that what happened the contents of CX register copied to this memory location CX already zero so will be zero again and I have the indirect addressing mode content of memory location BX which is 2200 2200 was also its contents are zero will be copied to ix if i type trace will be again zero and the very last one is base relative plus index which i have base plus index plus a number bx is already 2200 plus 2000 will be 4000 something and plus this will be its data the data in this memory location is zero will be copied to the DX register also will become zero and I am at the end of this instructions now if I check instruction pointer is at 12a if I want to execute my program directly from if I say U100 to 12a I will see all my instructions so I will just write execute my code from here up to here I will say G 100 to 12 A and enter will go up to there this program is created one time or I can say G equal CS 100 up to 12 A same method or same idea another command which is called E enter I can enter data to memory segments I can say enter DS0 and just write 0 1 2 3 4 if I check now D0 up to where up to 5 or up to 4 I will see that I have written 0 1 2 3 4 as I written here by default is data segment I or I can say D DS 0 space 4 
will be same or I can say DDS 0 comma 4 will be the same I have another command which called fill if I want to fill data segment from 0 up to F with for example EE I'll write this command so now if I want to check the memory location 0 to F I will see all its data became EE also I can say F from 0 up to F change the data to AA and if I want it became AA I have another command which is called search I can search for uh, data for example in a data segment 0 up to 100 I want to search for AA I have AA in all these memory segments from 0 up to F I have AA as I written before if I want to search for a word or for, for a character I will just say DS from I can say also S0 up to how much to 100 which character exclamation mark and enter I will see it at location 51 if I say D 51 it's 21 ASCII code which is uh, equal to exclamation mark I have another command which has inputs and output if I say out I will say 70 04 and input 71 it will show me current time which is 16 which is 4 o'clock p.m. 4 p.m. also I can say out 70 sorry 70 zero 01 zero 02 this will show me input and 71 this will show me the minutes I have another command which is called hex hex show me the addition and subtraction of hexadecimal numbers I, I will say H A A A and 541 enter it will show me the first one is the addition for them if I plus this two number will be this F E B and if I subtract A A A 541 will be 569 for me this is the addition and subtraction of hexadecimal number I have move commands I will say move before that I will check the data of uh, 0 up to F which is AA I will copy this data to another offset of data segment for example to D0 I will say just I will copy to this location offset 20 so what I will say move data segment 0 to F starting address is 20 so now I will check D20 its contents became AA so I move the data of offset 0 to offset 20 if I say D0 I will see offset 0 is AA copy to offset 20 we have proceed commands like uh, we can say trace we can give starting and ending starting and number of instruction I will say is yes hundred uh, five steps so like trace it's because if I want just to quite from this process I will just type Q and enter and from here I will just write exit in this experiment also we have physical and logical addressing how to know them logical address is dealt by the computer itself which is shown by computer so we have segment and its offset segment registers like we have CS, DS, SS, ES and uh, offset like instruction pointer like uh, BX, DI, SI and some others base pointer, stack pointer all of them physical address is the actual uh, address of the memory to calculate physical address this is an example if we have segment 1B0F and offset FF00 
physical address will be like this segment will be multiplied by 10 hexa 1 0 hexa and then last by offset <coughs> so 1 b 0 f multiplied by 10 hexa will be 1 b 0 f 0 plus f f 0 0 the result physical address its actual location of memory will be 2a f f 0 and that's all thank you for watching this video